Franklin, Auburndale youth soccer coach behind bars accused of running a large-scale marijuana growing operation. Investigators believe Micah Crane was operating a grow house out of a Winter Haven home that he rents. News Channel 8's Melissa Marino tells us investigators believe this soccer coach was leading a scandalous double life. This may look like a normal house in a quiet Winter Haven neighborhood, but inside... When you take the value of all the 300 excess plants and all the actually cultivated processed marijuana, he's got, it's, you know, it's north of a uh, of million and a half dollars worth of marijuana. Investigators are calling it one of the most sophisticated grow houses they've ever seen in Polk County. A fertilizer, you know, liquid nutrition for these plants. I mean, it's quite a, it's quite a setup. This video shows undercover detectives raiding the house and destroying all of the equipment. Uh, the fuse box that he's got and the electrical, he was able to avoid the uh, meter and a great electrical setup. Just as shocking, investigators believe this man, Micah Crane, was running the operation. He's an Auburndale Scream youth soccer coach. Apparently, he has a he has a good reputation of being a good coach and a, and a good guy. So, but obviously, he led a double life. They're being a mentor to kids, and he's a major league drug cultivator, and uh, very likely a drug dealer. Neighbors never saw it coming. He had us totally fooled because we thought he lived there. You know, he had uh, a dog that uh, you know was there, and I mean, he washed the car out in the driveway and. You know, he put candy out for the kids at uh, Halloween and decorated at Christmas time. And According to the Auburndale Scream organization, he passed all necessary background checks. He's currently suspended pending the outcome of this investigation. In Polk County, Melissa Marino, News Channel 8.